Hello and welcome back to Vape the Va the Vape the Vape Vape every freaking video. Vape the Gathering. Okay, and, and Tyler's really gonna blow a bunch of shit in my face. Yeah. <laughs> okay, as you can see, I got a new shove cap. <laughs> yep, because he busted his gla his glass cap. Thank you, fifty mile per hour winds. <laughs> Alright, we're here with a few juice reviews today. Um, I'm doing numb skulls. It actually came in a box. Actually, I have another box over here. Um, it came in this box. I got these both at um, Endless Vapes over in Danvo, PA for... I think, yeah, it says 34. It's it's flipped. It's It says 34. Flip it the other way. <laughs> yeah. 34, 34 bucks. And uh, this is the box. It comes in. So, two flavors, one deal. Yep, for 30 bucks. Um, here's the glass for Straw Nana by Numbskulls e liquid. Six milligram nick, that's all I had it in. I kind of had to settle with a higher nick that time. And we, it's freezing down here. Yeah, so, if I start shaking, it's, cold. <laughs> it's freaking cold. Because we're in Tyler's basement. My cold ass basement. And this is Wapple, watermelon apple as well. I've had these for about two weeks. So I'm through almost half of them already. Yeah, I know. I just got a new flavor today, which we'll, we won't be reviewing today, but we will be reviewing later. Um, Slaughter Pops. So we won't be reviewing that yet because I haven't had it long enough. But uh, eventually, probably the next video. Yeah, I'll be testing out. Um, oh. Juice roll-ups, raspberry. I'm pretty sure it only comes in three milligrams. So, there's that. <laughs> so, who's going first? I guess I'll go first. Let what me get all in there. Oh, nothing right now. I'm gonna drip, mm -hmm. drip some straw. Do you want me to build you a fucking coil for that? You have you have canthal? No, I didn't think so. I'm gonna drip some. Um, uh, straw nana on here. Wow. Otherwise, yeah. Otherwise, yeah, you could build me a coil. I thought you brought your canthal. No, it wasn't smart enough. It was. A, it's still a call egg. It's still a call egg. Yeah, it's still a call egg. I didn't think I'd need to. Um. Okay, so I just dripped a bunch of straw nana on here, freshly wicked. I am. I'm only running a single right now because my other one got screwed over. So here we go. I'm dripping straw nana on there, making sure this is tight, and. Uh, hit it. Very nice cloud production. Um, it's definitely you can definitely taste the um, banana in it. Um, seeing as how the nick's a little stronger than usual, I'm, I'm getting a little bit of a nick flavor in there. It's kind of throwing the flavor off, but nothing too awful. Um, it'd probably be a little better if I had three, seeing as how I'm used to it. Tyler, if you want to take a crack. And his nostril holes. Yeah, that's where the flavor comes from. Yeah. Breathe out your nose, you get the flavor. Mm, it definitely has a banana flavor to it. Oh, you're right. It's pugnant, that's for sure, coming out. Yeah. On the exhale. Um, all in all, I'm not much of a banana fan. Never was to begin with. What, just bananas in general? <laughs> yeah, bananas in general. Never been a big fan of them. <laughs> so, I'd probably rate that a 5 on mine, but it is good. I mean, I don't taste the nicotine that much on it. It is a smooth hit, no matter what. Oh. And we got this <laughs> here. <laughs> Freaking postage roll for blowing O's. Yeah. Postage rolls. Um, if you want to go ahead and review yours. Um, by the way, I just take, thought I'd take this moment and thank um, the guys at Flip in Pittsburgh. If you haven't watched our previous video, go to Flip. I forget what street is that on in Pit in Pitt? It's on Wood Street. Yeah, it's on Wood Street in Pittsburgh. Um, just look up for the flashing neon lights in the window. It's um it's up on the second story next to a candy store. I forget what the name of the candy store but it is off the top of my head. But it's next to a CVS on Wood Street. Yeah, if you can find the C it's not on, the C V S isn't on Wood Street. No, it's not on Wood Street, but it's near Wood Street. It's, it's like right by uh town or yeah, the square. Yeah. Target Square. So if you go up there, the uh, the guy who runs it is um, I think he put us Mike. on yeah Mike he yeah, put Mike. us on um, his Instagram or something, 
Um, hopefully we're getting connections. And, and since that's happened, I think we've gotten two more subscribers. So to our two new subscribers, welcome to the channel. Hi, guys. <laughs> but yeah, definitely... If you're in the Pittsburgh area, hit up Flip because they're soon to be. They're just starting out. Um, they're gonna be going to the vape, um, the Vape Expo yeah, over the Vape in, Expo in Harrisburg area in next the, month in April, I think. Right? Isn't it in April? Yeah. Yeah, down in Harrisburg. So they'll be getting a lot more stuff in. They're just starting out, but um, the, they're soon to be growing. And, and the changes that they made so far to it, it's it's more of a, it's the only lounge in Pittsburgh that I found that really is. Um, it's a place where you can just chill. Chillax, yeah, and it's really nice and inviting, and it's it's not just a vape shop; it's also a pawn shop if you want to go in for. Um, you get an Xbox, get PlayStation games. Yeah, you can sell you can sell the, your vape get stuff there as well. Cameras, get really old DVD players. Atari, laser discs, all sorts of stuff. Just art. hit up, just hit up. Yep, yeah, art. You can display your art there and stuff. It's really cool. Just hit up vape or flip, and uh, the F is flipped actually. Yeah, the mm -hmm. F is actually flipped in the logo. But, um, yep, um, definitely hit up those guys. They're awesome. So, I just put the roll-ups in here. I'm going to take a hit. Yep. So, if you guys actually like raspberry flavors, roll-ups is just like a fruit roll-up raspberry. Like, it's like that blue raspberry roll-up that you can get. Like, right out of the pack. Tastes exactly like it. And if you're not much of a nicotine person, it's great because they get in zero and three, and you can't really get it any higher than that. I asked. Really? Yeah, they only sell it in three. Well, elevate. Does. Yeah, I elevate. Know. I don't know. I'm not sure if any other place does, but I give it a. Ooh, what do I give it? I didn't. I didn't actually rate banana, uh, straw nana. I give that a um, a seven point mm. five out of ten. It's not the best flavor I've ever had, but it's pretty good though. Since Pineapple Pow is my favorite, I give that a 9.5 the last time I tested it. I'm going to give this an 8 because I've been, I think I could steadily hit this constantly. So, Liam, you want to take a try? Yeah, what the hell? <clears throat> Trying to bait my um, cotton dry so I can put Wapple I'll on there. I'll that. All right, thank you. Slobber lips. All right. Is that you or me? <laughs> yeah, definitely good. What the heck was? Never mind. That was the six. <laughs> stupid. <laughs> stupid. 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 All right. Yeah, definitely good. Definitely a good raspberry. Let me take another hit. I didn't get really any flavor, really. I know it's like one of those softer flavors. It's smooth. Yeah, it's definitely smooth for sure. I'm just more of a strong raspberry, like a yeah, like a you know, like I've actually tried slaughter pops and it's it's really good. I'm I'm trying to build more of an eclectic taste to give you guys a better description. That's why I'm where we're waiting to the next video to review it, so I have a better grasp of what it really tastes like. But I've only taste tested it and took one one wick of it today, so um, I'm just gonna give you guys a better description next video of slaughter pops. It's actually another Lost Art, and as you guys know, I'm a big ass Lost Art fan. There was a, there was a 55 mil of that stuff at Elevate for 55 bucks, which was not a bad deal for 50, uh, or 55 bucks is like a 10 bucks per mil, so that wouldn't be a bad deal. I almost walked away with it, but I was like, yeah, I need to conserve money, seeing as how we just registered a beach trip. Oh yeah, big beach trip coming yeah. up. We're going to have cigars, we're going to have vape juice from, what was that one called down in Delaware again? Factor Vape? Yeah, Factor Vape. We're gonna check Assuming that it's place. still open. Yeah, it better be open. I'm, I want to get more purple nurple. I want to get more cactus juice for Christ's sake. If not, I'm going to try to find it online. Christ Wicks, would you dry? Good yeah, we can't God. can't my basement out because we got two fire alarms down here. Well, I deactivated one of them. No, it still went Is off it? the one day. Did it really? <laughs> it went off. Frickin' A. What, yesterday? No, uh, when AJ was over. Oh. <laughs> oh, no, I know. It wasn't AJ. It was just Quentin and Cody who set that thing off by accident. Well, of course they did. Oh, well. <laughs> Alright, I'm not really gonna... As long as that one doesn't go, go off, off. fine. Yeah, I'm just trying to dry these things. They're not drying for some reason. I've been hitting it and hitting it. It didn't even drip that much on there. That's why it sucks running single. Even though this is the vape, the end of my vape that fires. For some reason, my freaking vape fires better on one end than it does the other. But 
It's it depends the, how your coils are wrapped. To, yeah, wrapped. that's how long the leads are from the and if you bend center. the leads. <laughs> oh, come on, you're gonna wrap me out on that. <laughs> I got you down to point oh eight ohms I at know, one time. I know. I can't believe you actually did that. <laughs> So um, while we're waiting for this thing to dry, um, we we're, we're gonna be uh, trying to get a video up every week for new subscribers. Seeing as how this channel is gonna be taking off, we're trying to get Cody, who was here earlier, in on this. Sorry about wiping my face; my freaking eye itched. Um, trying to get more videos every week, um, if we can. Yes, every week we will send out a new video for you peoples. <laughs> I want to do that. <laughs> Yes, every week we're going to be trying to put up a video um, it's for new subscribers, um, whoever's going to be getting in from uh, Flip sites or just finding us on YouTube. Um, be sure to follow us. Like It helps a lot for our channel, it, we're, even though we're just starting out. Why the heck is my hair so scratchy? Probably because I just got a haircut. We both got a haircut. What yeah. are you going? I'm just going over here to grab something quickly to show them. Do you still have the busted? Yeah, I do. <laughs> That's what he's getting. He's getting his busted freaking glass cap. Depending where the frick it went. Hope it don't cut hey, well, I'm gonna set a screen myself. <laughs> <laughs> sort of got that it ends up being the thumbnail. Oh my god. Um, Set it. Nope. That solar flare. <laughs> dry I hear, wicks. I hear it down there. Dry. Oh, they're almost there. Good. Thank God. Where the fuck did it go? Can move on with this Hello? video. Where are you? So anyway, this is this is Tyler's basement. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look at all the workout equipment. Yeah, seriously, all these freaking bikes and lift bars and shit. Um, so in? yep, we're home right now. We're gonna be going back to pit here pretty soon. Um, I'm coming back this coming <laughs> Sunday as of upload because we're gonna have to upload this right after this. There you are. Um, as of upload, we're, I'm going to be heading out Wednesday. Um, if you guys, another channel you guys should check out if you um, are interested in gaming is uh, Monk Cheese. I do a gaming channel as well. Slide over, dumbass. I'm slide over. If you guys want to check out a gaming channel, I run a gaming channel called Monk Cheese. Uh, it's it was started out as a really shitty channel, but I've got a capture card, so now it's starting to kick off. So I'm yeah, doing much I'm, better quality on I'm, that. I'm doing. Um, Borderlands 2, I'm um, 11 episodes deep, so if you guys want to catch up, start watching now, because my videos are somewhat extensive. Not, like, really, really extensive, like, hour-long episodes, but they're, like, half an hour. You're the cutting most. them down? I'm, I'm starting to cut down, so. Okay, so, <laughs> this used to be my turbo of cap. Oh, you could still use that! I don't want to tear my lips <laughs> apart. That thing freaking chipped in half right there. <laughs> I thought you meant it actually broke straight no, in half. No, it didn't break straight in half. It just broke in You realize half. you could just take the, the the glass off there. Yeah, I could. I mean, yeah, and two just, pieces. You could just save that part and get another chuff cap. Yeah, but, I mean, Scott didn't gave it come, Wait, didn't it come with two glass? No, it came with one glass piece. Oh, that's right. Yeah, Scott was actually really nice and gave me this awesome cap on this thing. Yeah, it looks sick. It looks a lot better, actually. Well, I like the glass because... 25 you, bucks for that. The reason I like the glass is you can actually see the the, the, yeah. the vape coming through the glass, and it was really cool looking. That was a really cool thing. Now I have to worry about this thing heating up, but I don't mind that so much. Yeah, like, that's why I like having a plastic chef cap. I want I want to get something... Put Comment. If there's anything for the Buddha, you can actually mod it for a drip tip or anything. Um, I want to look up getting a modded drip tip that looks really cool on here. So this bland plastic piece of shit but um just comment in the in the description or not in the description freaking the comment section below if there's anything on the buddha or any mods or any juices you'd like to see us review um that we could try to get our hands on um any lost arts that you would recommend to me or any cosmic fogs or any crap that you would want us to review just uh, put in the description any tech by the way if you want us to see i mean Granted that we're on a budget here. Yeah. I mean, we're college students, so don't be asking us to go we're get like as college students. Don't be don't be asking us to go get like hundred dollar mods because we like unless you want to ship us them for <laughs> review. By yeah, all means, that's never gonna happen. You're never gonna ship us anything. I know. Are those wings fucking dry yet? 
They should be. Yeah, they're dry. They're dry. Okay. Off. I'm putting them on. All right, I'm going to throw on Wapple, Wapple, which is actually, I didn't like Wapple as much as I liked Straw Nana, because you can really, really taste the, uh, the, uh, freaking nicotine on this one, but it's, uh, it's pretty good, though. It skull. It smells a lot better than Straw Nana, but it just, it's, the taste of the Nick just freaking kills it for me. But, uh, I'm going to give you guys a review. You're a pussy. Shut up. 12 strength freaking solar flare piece of crap. Oh, yeah, I'm out of that at this point. I thought you got another. Oh, that's right. You no. wanted to get another. Okay, well, let me let me take another hit of this because this gets distracting me from taste. All right. Okay, so that's straw in it. <laughs> Dropped my mod earlier, and that was a bunch of crap on it. Um, so, Straw Nana is, um, not Straw Nana, Christ, Wapple, Wapple. is, um, a very nice, um, watermelon, apple f flavor, um, it, you get more of the sour, a it's more of a sour apple kind of taste, it's, you kind of lack the watermelon, but, um, watermelon. yeah, if you want to take a hit off that, and I give it, like, a, a 6.5 only because of the nicotine, otherwise it would be right on par with Straw Nana. But the nicotine kind of just killed it for me. But if I got it in the lesser strength, it probably wouldn't be so bad. So I'm going to give it a 6.5 with the nicotine, 7.5 for just probably just regular. I'm just assuming so. But, uh, yeah, that's that's what I've been dealing with. Yeah, it's actually a little bit of a hard hitter there. Yeah. That sour taste, I'm not digging it that much. Really? What are you rating it? I'm rating it at a 4. Really? Yeah, for some reason, I'm just not liking that sour. I mean, I can taste the apple, but... Right. Mm. It's okay. I mean... Okay, yeah. I mean, for 30 bucks, I, mean, I couldn't really pass it down. here, but... Yeah. I mean, for 30 bucks, I really couldn't pass it down, even though I didn't taste test it or nothing, because... It, just like Flip, if, um, Endless Vapes... By the way, you should definitely go check them out as well. Um, sh definitely... Um, is is just starting but they've actually grown a lot since i first went in there when they first started but uh definitely i'm um, going to endless vapes as well, uh endless vapes in danville as well they're right next to um danville yeah yeah danville right next to the Valkner's beer distributor <laughs> so um if you if you just they're right next to the train tracks so you can't miss it it's right there for all you 21 year olds out there order <laughs> yeah Valkner's. That's where my dad goes for his for his liquor. So, um, definitely hit hit up Wagner's. <laughs> Wagner's, <laughs> holy shit, Wagner's! It's like a, it's like an industrial sized freaking storage unit for liquor. Like it's <laughs> that big. It's it's actually quite impressive. They got boxes, some freaking cans. They got bottles. They got freaking Jack. They got I think they got Jack. Don't quote me on that, but they have a lot of like ale and um, beer. So it's a vape channel we're talking about. About liquor, beer. yeah, about, liquor. about it. When we're twenty one, this is probably gonna convert into a freaking Alcoholics Anonymous channel. <laughs> <laughs> Just a mixed media. <laughs> it's like a Van Gogh painting. Yeah, how about it. The swirls of everything. Well, that will about do us since we're closing in on 18 minutes. I want you to... 19 minutes. About 19 minutes. Yeah, we're closing in on 19 minutes. Uh, we're going to end it here. Um, we'll catch back up with you guys maybe when we get back to Pit. I'm not sure. We're, we're kind of tossing around ideas because it's going to be opening weeks and we're going to be pretty jammed. Well, not really jammed, but just getting into the classes and everything. But uh, we'll catch you guys in the next one. Catch you later.